Crews have been out across the DMV working to restore power. At the uh, height of the storm last night, more than 8,000 people didn't have lights or air conditioning. But we checked Pepco's outage map in the last five minutes, and only a couple of dozen people are still being impacted by outages this morning, mainly in Montgomery County. Dominion Energy says about 200 people remain without power in Fairfax County. Our Randy Ayala drove around Montgomery County, Maryland in the past hour to see where damage still remains this morning. Now we're here at University Boulevard East and East Franklin Avenue in Silver Spring. You can see the Pepco trucks uh, here behind me, and this is the location where we had uh, a down tree and down power lines last night. Let's go ahead and show you that video. Uh, we were here as crews were making repairs, and they were able to repair things rather quickly. Uh, things this morning looking a okay about 20 minutes from here. We were in Potomac, Maryland on Lloyd Road where a huge tree came down. We were able to grab some video there, but again, crews getting to work overnight and everything here in Silver Spring looking much better this morning. Uh, Jonathan is still tracking more scattered showers, so today is a really uh, great day to be weather aware and make sure you have our app downloaded to your phone in Silver Spring. Randy Ayala WUSA 9. Well, when, when weather is the, the big story, we'd love to help you cover it. Uh, grab your, we love your help in covering it, uh, rather. Grab your phone and scan this QR code or visit WSA9.com slash weatherwatchers and sign up to help us cover your community.